ride-sharing app Uber has made its way back to Auburn. But before you take a ride in one of the trendy taxis, there are a few things you need to know to stay safe. News Leader 9's Brandon Etheridge reports. It's, I think it's great. It's great for the, the people that, the riders and the drivers. Excitement is a common feeling among Uber drivers now that the ride-sharing service has made its way back to Auburn. The drivers and riders are not the only ones excited. Officials with Auburn's Department of Public Safety are also looking forward to the added safety benefits. Uh, you know, one of the concerns in a college town is certainly drinking and driving, and so there have been some studies since Uber has come about that show that um, in cities that have used the service that there have been pretty significant reductions in drunk driving arrests and drunk driving crashes. And while many students see the benefit of Uber being in town, some are still not sold on the idea of getting into a car alone with a stranger. I think it's better than having people drive, you know, if they're under the influence or something, but I wouldn't take it by myself. I would rather people take it with a group or something like that. But if you ever feel unsafe while using a rideshare application, public safety officials say you can download the Rave Guardian app which acts as a safety timer on your smartphone. Maybe you're going for your Uber ride and it's going to take you 15 minutes. You can set your safety timer for 15 minutes and select somebody as you in, and they can track where you're going um, during that time. And if you don't turn off your timer, then they get an alert saying that you're your timer is an alarm and that they need to check on you. Now the Rave Guardian app is available for everyone, but for those Auburn students that download the app and register their .edu email address, you have the added benefit of being able to text the Auburn Police Department. Reporting in Auburn, Brandon Etheridge, WTVN News Leader 9. Thank you.